Hello and welcome to Kentucky Brew Reviews. I'm Radar. I'm Special K. When we were at the Buffalo Trace Distillery not too long ago. We decided to stop at a gas station from the get, future and get a slushy. And uh, you know what I saw in there? This lovely, lovely blue raspberry sour four loco. I can't see. And it. I said, Radar, look, we haven't reviewed that. Let's buy, let's buy it. And the Radar proceeded to throw a tantrum. I can't. I'm not going to look at it. I'm not opening my eyes for the rest of this video. So, Four loco, Sour Blue Raspberry, we have to review all of them. That's our job. Mm -hmm. uh, this is 14% alcohol by volume. Now, to be fair, the sour ones are better than the regular ones. I'm only opening my eyes if it's decent. Uh, if you didn't know, Four Locos have an obscene amount of sugar and calories in them, but they don't have to put that in the can because of... Because it's alcohol, and you don't yeah. have to put... You don't have to put the uh, the nutrition facts Not on alcohol the color in Kentucky. I was expecting it. Not the color at all. I was expecting. I need you to describe it. Um, oh. ocean water. What? I mean, you know what? It's supposed to be sour blue, right? You can open your eyes now. I don't want to. <laughs> oh, it's the friendly water from Moana. At least it's not like the the hurricane blue. <laughs> It's the friendly water from Moana. If I looked at this, I would be like, that's fake looking, but it probably tastes nice and fruity. But that's without smelling it, of course. So let's smell it. Um, it smells like... It smells like sour candies. And Four loco Funk. Mm-hmm. So that malty, moldy kind of corn smell. It smells, you know what it smells like? It smells like the cheap, the like less than store brand. Uh, sour candies, uh, the ones in the little red bag, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. It more it reminds me of um, like the off-brand Pixie Sticks. Mm. Not, you know the ones in the plastic tubes, not yeah, the actual. Yeah, yeah. I'm never going to understand why plastic tubes are cheaper than paper ones. Because China. Right. <laughs> <laughs> it's not that bad. Yeah, it's not as bad as the other ones. It still made me make that face. Um, <laughs> it's it's really sweet. It's very sweet. It's also it's sour. It's syrupy. I'll give it that it is sweet and sour. I don't know what that flavor is behind it. Behind the sweetness and the sourness? Corn. <laughs> Old corn. No, I mean the, the fruity, the sweet flavor that goes with it. Corn syrup. <laughs> It's what this is made with. I can almost taste the dye. Ah. I feel like I can almost taste the blue number nine or whatever it is. See, that's not my sour face. That, that's not my sour face. Sorry, my sour it, face is different. I can taste the certified color. It's, yes, it's certified colors. That makes it safer. So, uh, this is better. I would go, I'm going to go ahead and say this is better than all the 12% locos. Mm. So All of them? All the 12% locos. I don't remember which ones are twelve percent. So base, I'll take the that base on ones. That's the like the the punch, the peach, the watermelon, lemonade. Those the those. Peach was almost almost. De yeah, I could almost deal with the peach flavored one. So uh, it has. The problem with Four Locos again is it has that weird malty funk in it. This one has so much sugar and and, the, and sour stuff in it that it hides it a little bit better. Yeah. Um, but if if you're not looking for it, you're not going to find it. That that funk like. Um, I would say if you're drinking these through the night, the first half of it, you might detect it a little bit, um, but then once you're through that second half of the can, it's oh, no yeah. longer there. But well, also, depending on how you drink it. After two cans, you're going to have, you know, uh, you're going to diabetic I'm pretty shock. sure that most people who drink Four loco, like, just shotgun it. You just, they drink it as fast as possible because it's Four loco. Why does it... it my only problem with Four Loco again is that corny funk, and it's just, it's too much sugar. That's your only problem with Four Loco? They're super expensive, too. If we're going to talk about the problems with Four Loco, they're super expensive. They're, like, obviously geared towards children. Well, uh, this is two seventy nine a can, which, for something that's 14%, it's not that bad. I mean, 14% is pretty high. Mm. Hmm. It could ah. be better. I still think this is above average for these this style of beverages. I think I would drink Earthquake before I would drink this. Well, they make Earthquakes. Yeah, I know. Uh, and I think that's only 10% actually, now that I think about it. I don't effing care. It's Earthquake. It's gross. Yeah. It's probably all the same thing. They just add color, food coloring to Earthquake. Oh, that's weird. Um, so what would you rate this, Radar? 
Mmm, that burp got up into my nose. I'm sorry. That's <laughs> how that four loco funk. Mm -hmm. Uh, did you ask me to rate this? It's a. Uh, I did. It's a three and a half. Really? Yeah, I think if you chugged it, it wouldn't be so bad. But I don't want to chug it to find out. I think you're being a little harsh on it. I think it's almost as good as the green apple, which I think is the best one. Um, it's on par with the gold one. It's close to the gold one. Not quite there. Uh, I'm going to give this one a 5.5. I think it's slightly above average for this style of beverage. Um, I don't know if I could recommend it. I guess if you're into Locos, I could recommend this one because the sour ones, again, the sour ones and the gold one are the best ones, so the 14 percenters. I mean, if you're gonna drink a Loco, you might as well go all the way. Go with that 14 percent. Like, screw all that 12 and Yeah, I guess that's stuff. a good point. If you are gonna drink four Loco, like if you consigned yourself to that kind you know, of life. You know why you're drinking four Loco. You're not <laughs> drinking it for the flavor, you're drinking it to get If this is the up. lifestyle that you've chosen, or someone else has chosen for you by buying you a four Loco, <sighs> then that burp is really weird, man. <laughs> <clears throat> I think you're a little harsh on it. Um, the sourness really helps. The sourness helps a lot. Uh, I don't. I don't think. I'm pretty sure without the sourness, this would be like in the same sort of realm as the other blue one. What's the the roofing tar oh, flavor? Oh, the hurricane one. That was yeah. eh, foul. It's easily the worst logo. Oh, that was bad, man. Let's go operate some heavy machinery. Mm, that's probably a bad idea. Let's not do that. <laughs> yeah, uh, like I said, if you're a loco fan. Um, you know, go with this. If you want to try Loco, I don't know why anybody would want to actively try Loco because there are better malt beverages out there, yeah. for sure. I think if I drank all of that, just like really fast, I wouldn't be qualified to operate myself. You get to, uh, one thing about these is you feel the alcohol. Like it's it's warm. Like you, it's it's not like- Going you did, down, it's, shot. Yeah, it's weirdly, it's weirdly cold and warm at the same time. <laughs> but I mean, you know, I guess, it's so weird if you think about it. There's like not a lot of in-betweens. You either have seltzers or you have like locos. Uh, and there's, you know, there's kind of sort of Mike's hard, but those are really, there's nothing that's just semi-sweet. Everything is like, here's 84 grams of sugar or here's uh -huh. more sugar. Yeah, Can yeah. we have something that's lightly sweet? Is that a uh, thing? What about those um, Stella Artois spritzers? Spritzers? They spritzers. still have like 13 to 14 grams of sugar in them. I mean, it's sort of in between. It's sweet-ish. Oh, we're doing a video. Uh, I didn't tell you this yet. We're going to do a talking video. We've been doing a while talking about why, why seltzers are so popular. I, I, I've got, well, keep, I've got keep, a theory. Yeah, okay. keep it, yeah, yeah. All right. All right. Yeah, all right. Well, that's, <laughs> that's been our episode. If there's something you'd like to see on the channel, you can leave a comment right there. Leave a big one. I'm Special K. I'm Radar. Thanks for watching. I'm not drinking any more of that.